Right. So you can stop if you're downtown for any reason. You can just stop by. Stop by. I love those sweatshirts that just you, say or? the land. Like I'm, I'm all in on one of it those. It speaks yeah. for itself. Yeah. Sign you know, me up. If you're not from the land, then you know, scram. That's it. And this is totally <laughs> Chamber of Commerce weather that we continue to have. It's cool today, but the sun is still shining, people. Like. Don't start getting crazy on us. Thank goodness. Like, say, one thing at a time. The struggle is real. Yes. Yeah. It was real today. And we got a happy marriage going on right now between the land and also water. 56 degree lake temperature right now. 56 degrees at Cleveland Hopkins. We did not meet our forecast high, nor did we meet our average today, which is 74. 54 is the average morning low. And we're just only two degrees warmer than the morning low average right now. We got a strong northerly breeze just cruising right in off the shore there, right into northeast Ohio, which has kept our temperatures a bit more subdued today. However, we do have sunny and stable conditions because of this pertinent area of high pressure to the north, bringing in very strong northeast winds, roughly about 15 to 20 mile per hour gust right now. As a result, our temperatures have also been cooler from this point yesterday, 10 to 15 degrees colder from our Wednesday afternoon. Mid to upper 50s along the lake shore. We're pretty good here inland between Akron, Canton, down south, Holmes, Tuscarawas County, Carrollton County, even in getting over to Mahoning and also Youngstown region at this hour. The rest of the evening will be a bit chilly. So if you're coming downtown, maybe you're going for a late dinner tonight. Bear in mind, it's going to be a little bit of extra chill in the air. You're going to need a light jacket and maybe even a little bit of a coat as well. Overnight conditions likely to remain in the 40s along the lakeshore, but there's something that I want to point out to you guys that could be an issue for us inland. Tomorrow still may be a little bit of a struggle. 60s, I don't know if you want to get in the water, but maybe you want to hang out around the pool. We'll still have a lot of sunshine to keep you warm. But if you're going out on the boat tomorrow, still likely going to be a few chops out there. Not terribly high, but again, bit breezy. 10 to 15, not 2 to 3 feet waves. Now let's talk about the lake conditions. OK, a lot of people are going to be hitting the beaches here. Rip currents are still going to be a risk for us. So that is a persistent offshore wind. If you're going to be kind of maybe getting in the water a little bit, you need to swim perpendicular, or excuse me, you need to swim parallel to the shore because this persistent perpendicular offshore wind can maybe even travel about eight feet in a matter of seconds. So don't fight that current, okay? If you're gonna get in the water, swim parallel to the shore to escape the current. This is a real true risk for summertime beach goers, whether you're going to be going to the lake, maybe even going down to the Jersey Shore, maybe even going down to the mid to uh, southern Atlantic. This is an issue that we have to bear in mind for our summertime, at least our springtime months. Here's your National Design Hour hour by hour forecast. As I told you, there's something that we're watching here in that forecast. Later this evening, that northerly wind will persist in some areas. Look at that. Worcester, Mansfield, maybe even Canton. You could likely have some patchy areas of frost throughout the early morning hours for us on Friday. However, we're going to road that away once we get into the afternoon. High temperatures for our Friday and your Union Home Mortgage 7 a outlook will still be slower than at least a little bit cooler than the average mid to upper 60s. But by the time we get to Saturday and Sunday, boom, look at that. A warm front arrives for Memorial Day and that surge is even, even higher by Tuesday, Wednesday, back into the mid 80s we go. But a few pops next Wednesday. Well, Friday. Memorial Day, of course, the unofficial start to summer and it looks like the Weather is going to cooperate. Atmosphere Finally. says, all right, let's do this. I'm fine with that. Perfect. All right, thanks, Jason. We'll catch up with you again in about a half hour or so.